Hello everybody, what is up? My name is Killsteam. We are back and this video is a little bit late. I was planning to get this out like a couple of days ago, but so much school stuff came out and I'm finally having time to make it today. I was going to upload it last night, but I was really tired so I just went right to bed. So let's get right into this guys. So as you know, Rave in the Redwoods is coming out. It's just around the corner. A couple of more days left until we get to play this awesome new Zombies map. Now, there's some, a couple new things that is changing in this map. I, I know it's still going to be zombies. It's going to be set in the 90s and all that. It's set in this bear camp, lake thing camp. And then all of a sudden, um, these kids are having a party here. It's, they're having a rave party. And everything just goes glowing at one point. It's all party, awesome, crazy shit everywhere. It's really, really cool stuff. But then um, it changes back to an old, gloomy, scary camp. And then it changes back to a party again. It's really, really cool, dynamic feature they put in this map. Now... As you guys know, back in Zombies in Spaceland, on round 6, I believe, or somewhere around round 6, uh, I think it's random, but clown rounds do spawn in clowns, and that was back in Zombies in Spaceland. Now, instead of clowns, they're going to be spawning in Bigfoots. As you see right here, this is the new version of clowns for the clown round. Now, it's going to be called the Bigfoot round, I guess. So... Pretty, pretty awesome stuff. And now the Slasher. The Slasher is like the Brute. And it's like the new and improved Brute in Raven and Redwoods. It is going to appear in the Rave mode. So I believe the Rave mode is like where everything is all glowing and a party and all that crazy stuff. So this guy's going to appear during the Rave mode. Very, very awesome stuff. And this is a new weapon that is coming to Rave in the Redwoods. Um, as you see, it's a crossbow. Really, really sick weapon. We've seen this in the trailer, actually. I posted that as my thumbnail for the DLC 1 trailer. So go check that out. So yeah, guys. Pretty, pretty awesome trailer for Rave in the Redwoods. The trailer gave us a lot of new stuff. We've seen gameplay of the Slosh. We've seen Bigfoot gameplay and all that awesome stuff. Here is the Bear Lake Summer Camp layout right here. This is like the whole map Rave in the Redwoods right here, guys. Um, it looks pretty small, but I believe it's going to be much bigger in game. So yeah, it's, it looks like a medium-sized map probably, I'll say. Not like a large, large map. I think like Zombies in Space Sun was pretty a pretty decent-sized map. But um, this looks like a medium-sized map. Not too big and not too small. Pretty, pretty cool stuff. And then here is the artwork for four characters. And here is the extra character, Kevin Smith. Um, if some of you guys do not know, Kevin Smith, he's like this big um, director guy. He works on The Flash. He works on Supergirl. He works on video games and all that awesome stuff. This guy's like a big-time comic book. Dude, he just goes, like, hopping the place to place, hopping to company to company, and just doing little stuff here and there. And now he actually showed up in Infinity Ward, and now they're going to be putting him in a Zombies in Spaceland. So somehow, some way, we're going to be playing as him, or maybe we're going to call him in just like we called in David Hasselhoff back in Zombies in Spaceland. But besides Kevin Smith with the hockey um, jersey on, we have the four other characters, as you know. It's AJ, Andre, um, Poindexter, Sally, and all that awesome stuff, guys. Um, as you see, the outfits change a lot. They look like a totally different person, but it looks pretty, pretty awesome, guys. So, yeah, the like button, comment, and subscribe if you are very hyped up for Rave in the Redwoods. I'm not too sure about this, guys. Like, I guess I'm not, I'm not really that excited. Like, I'm excited, but I'm not like, whoa, I'm, I'm not going to go crazy and everything and do, like, a countdown at midnight on my PS4 like we did the Horizons Rock or Revelations or something like that. I'm not going to do that. But yeah, I am somewhat excited for this new DLC coming out on January 31st on the PlayStation 4. There's also a side of four new epic multiplayer maps. We got Afghan Remake. Very, very awesome stuff. I'm very hyped up for that. So yeah, guys, hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. I'll be seeing you guys in the next one, everybody. Peace out, guys.